here to talk about a weather event that hit our region and other parts of our states. Uh, this was some 20 years ago on yeah. Veterans Day weekend in 2002. Tornadoes tore yeah. across 17 states. That included Tennessee. A total of 76 tornadoes touched down. But we're going to focus on one that hit Cumberland County. This EF3 tornado right here. That storm hit around 930 at night. Yeah. And 18 people were wounded in that storm. We saw four killed. Let's talk about the damage path for this tornado, Todd. Yeah. It was some 900 yards. That's about nine football fields or so. Yeah, John, in the Lake Tansy area, and certainly, uh, unfortunately, the fatalities, the injuries. And uh, yeah, this was on a night. And keep in mind, in November, we talked earlier, the, we had the warm stretch of weather. Uh, November, you can have Indian summer, second summer. So we had a warm, moist, humid night ahead of a cold front. And those winds coming up into the Sequatchie Valley in Cumberland County, producing that EF3 tornado. Four fatalities here in Lake Tansy. John, another one, Mossy Grove, Morgan County, also an EF3 with 175 mile per hour winds, had seven fatalities. Uh, five in Mossy Grove and two in Joiner. So Lake Tansy here in Cumberland County, Mossy Grove in Morgan County, bad tornadoes that night. Just to underline though, yeah. it is rare in November to see a tornado like it that. is. It's it, we do have a secondary severe weather season in parts of November, not always, but you get that warm before the cold. That's what we've been experiencing this November as well. All right, Todd. Thank you very much for the explanation. Let's move on now and talk a little bit more about the headlines to come. Uh, let's talk about this green that's on the radar. We want to yeah. bring it back to the radar right now and talk more about what's happening across the region. Yeah, John, just to kind of reiterate, I mean, you know, we just talked about the warm to cold. We had the warm. Now we're getting the colder air and look at what they're seeing in Missouri and uh, northern parts of Arkansas. Of course, uh, Missouri is now in East Tennessee with the taking on the Vols coming up uh, for tomorrow's ball game. But this colder air is going to be moving in. We're going to see mainly some light rain spreading in tomorrow. So folks are heading out the game. Got some light rain in the morning and it's going to be breezy and chilly in the afternoon. So you want to dress warmly for the ball game tomorrow. Todd, appreciate it. Thank you for yeah. that smaller picture and the big picture as well. 